Hello, puppet. What's up, guys? It is white out here, and today we have some Battlefield 3 again. Yes, Battlefield 3 is where it's at. That's what I've been playing actually for quite some time now, and uh, I don't feel like going back to Modern Warfare 3 just yet. Uh, Modern Warfare 3 has been bugging the crap out of me, and I just need a little bit of a break, like I said before. So. Battlefield 3 is here. Battlefield 3 is going to stay for a little while. So, guys, got to get used to Battlefield 3, okay? Um, I know on Modern Warfare 3 they just released a uh, a patch for the lag that, that it's been having and that it's actually had since the day of release. But they did release a patch to, uh, to cure that effect. Um... But here on Battlefield 3, I am running the A91 with silencer and uh, I like to call it a red dot. It's not really a red dot, it's, some, it's a weird sight, I don't know. But I call it a red dot because it's most, probably damn near the closest thing to it in here. But um, yeah, I, I, I actually found a new game mode. It's not a new game mode to the game or anything. But it's Team Deathmatch. I always played Conquest or, you know... Uh, Rush or something like that, but Team Deathmatch in Battlefield 3 is absolutely amazing. I've been having so much trouble leveling up my weapons and things like that because it takes so long to level up a fucking weapon. You know, I don't understand that. And I, I was like, how did they expect you to, you know, how did they expect you to get your sniper rifles leveled up and get more sniper rifles? Well, I just went through the different game modes and I found Team Deathmatch. So. Actually, for all night now, I've been playing TDM, and uh, I'm having a fucking blast, alright? And I don't care what you say, but I like this TDM better than the Call of Duty TDM. See, I grew up playing COD, I, I grew up playing Call of Duty, but it's just, I guess it's time for a change, you know? After a while, some people get sick of things, they grow out of things, and they want to play something different, or they want something new. Well, and I guess this is my something new. <clears throat> oh my god. I think I'm getting sick yet again. Which is not good. Um, Like I said, uh, last time I talked to you guys was in my Minecraft commentary. And I did tell you guys that I was getting a new PC. Hmm. Yes, that is right. I'm getting a new PC. Um, it's, uh, basically it's going to be a Windows, uh, Windows 7. It's going to be have an Intel Core i7 processor, uh, 2600K. Uh, the, basically the K means it's unlocked so you can, uh, overclock it and things. I don't know a lot of my subscribers if they know about computers or not. I'm not big, big in knowing about a lot of computers. But I've been learning a few things here and there in the last week. As I've been trying to get parts together, you know, I was going to get parts together and just build a PC on my own and have uh, someone just stick it together for me, buy all the parts separately. But I found uh, a better way of doing things so I can get a really decent PC. Um, it's going to be built for me. When it it, by the time it's delivered, it'll all be put together. It's not going to be coming parts like I was going to do. Um, Right now, I'm getting it from uh, Cyber Power PC. Uh, I'll have their website in the description if you guys want to check that out. They got some pretty amazing PCs. But uh, like I said, yes, I'm getting an Intel Core i7 uh, 2600K Sandy Bridge model processor. And uh, a couple of NVIDIA graphics cards that are going to be installed in it. And uh, it's going to be a pretty beast PC. I, I honestly, I can't wait. I cannot wait for it to be here. Um, on the 31st, so not long after Christmas, I'm going to be finalizing the order. And I will probably have the PC, I'm guessing, within 30 days or so after that. Um, I'm hoping it's not even 30 days because that's a month. And I, I really don't want to sit out a month. 
Because a month without my PC that I've ordered, and I know it's on its way, but it's like right there chewing and gnawing at the back of my neck because I want it, but I can't get it because it's not here yet. Um, but that's that's basically what it's going to be. Um, I'm, yes, the new PC is going to be on its way as of the 31st. I'm finalizing all the, the you know, the order of the shipment. The 31st, it'll be on its way. And, uh... Minecraft. I'll be able to play some more Minecraft. Uh, right now, when I play Minecraft, the game is a little bit laggy, a little bit shaky because of my PC that I, my current PC that I'm doing this on right now, it's just a Dell Studio, and uh, it's only about five or six months old. But we ordered it straight from Dell. We didn't know upgrading or any of that good stuff, and it just can't handle, you know, Java games for some reason. When I run Java games on the on the uh, on this PC, it just lags so fucking bad. It's unbelievable. I can't stand it, and I honestly won't go for it anymore. So that is my reasoning for going buying a brand new gaming PC. Um, I this PC is going to be liquid cooled eventually. Uh, right now, I'm not going to upgrade. Um, I'm going to order it without the liquid cooling, and then later on, I'm going to stick it in. I'll order it, and I'll probably order a kit for liquid cooling for the new PC. And um, just do it that way instead of ordering right up front. Uh, the PC that I'm looking at right now is going to cost me uh, a good uh, a good 1800 bucks, and which is not bad for what's all in it. and it, It's pretty damn good. It, it's got 8 gigs of RAM. It's, it's not a huge RAM. But it's got amazing graphics cards and amazing, uh, an amazing processor. And now that I got some people that know what they're doing and they, you know, they can help me out with uh, setup and setting this PC up, it's gonna, it's gonna be really great for me. So uh, stay tuned, stick around for some games and shit from that. Um, I've never been a PC gamer in my life. I've always been console like Xbox 360 and uh, PlayStation 3, but. Now it's time to move on because there's so many games out there on the PC that I want to play and uh, I can't because my PC doesn't stand up for the uh, standards of that. Oh, and I'm going to be getting Battlefield 3 for that PC as well. Uh, Battlefield 3 comes free with the graphics card that I uh, have installed, having installed in that PC. So <clears throat> basically, it's a special where if you buy the certain graphics card, uh, you get. A game free with it and this just happened to be battlefield 3 you get with it so i'm getting battlefield 3 for the pc with it so i'm gonna have a, a fucking blast battlefield 3 on the pc instead of console this time it just sounds so amazing to me and i am very excited um i'm about to piss myself i'm so excited it's just something i've wanted for a while but uh yeah so you know stick around for that guys and I will be back with some more Battlefield 3, um, Call of Duty eventually, and some more Minecraft. I, I gotta get into playing some more Minecraft, so I will bring you some more of them before my new PC comes. They're still gonna be the same quality they are now, but when that new PC comes, it'll be all straight, I promise. But anyway guys, I'm gonna let you guys finish out the rest of the game. Please check out my annotations for some cool, kick-ass videos. And uh, I'll be back with some more gameplay and commentary, so stay tuned, guys, alright? Peace.